Hi, I'm Mark Hoagley, JCB's North American Service Manager, and today I'd like to take a few minutes and discuss how you can reduce your maintenance costs on your backhoe loader by just performing a few daily checks before operating your machine. To start out the check, the first thing we're going to do is actually look at the hydraulic oil and ensure that we can visually see oil in the glass. In this part of the service, we'll be actually looking in the engine compartment to look at fluid levels. The first check we're going to make is on our windshield wiper level, ensuring that it's topped off to the, to the maximum level. On our antifreeze, we're going to ensure that we're between our minimum and maximum line at a cold. And then we're going to look at our brake level, ensure that the fluid is all the way to the top. Continuing in the engine bay, we're going to look at our engine oil every morning, ensuring that it's topped off. and our transmission fluid. One of the parts that's usually missed in an inspection is visually inspecting the radiator to ensure I have no blockage of any kind, of any dirt, of anything that will actually overheat this machine during operation. We're then going to move to the tires, the front and rear tire. It's a good time to actually take a look at the tire to ensure that there's no holes or punctures in it. Looking at the inflation of the tire, ensuring that if I have an issue at this point I can make a change now. I'm also going to visually look at each lug nut, touching them and ensuring that each one is secure onto the rim. One of the checks that's usually missed on a machine is greasing it daily. It's very vital that you grease your machine on a daily basis to ensure that you expand the life of the components on the machine. Depending on what implement is physically attached to the front, it may have its own separate grease points. On this one, we just have a shovel. But you want to make sure that you hit every single pin every pivot point has a nipple and that you're actually greasing those points. Another one that's usually missed is on the axle pivot point. On this particular backhoe, our grease point is here. It may vary based on the model that you have. As we move to the back of the machine, we want to make sure we're looking underneath it and around for any hydraulic leaks that we may see that would point out to a loose hose. We eventually get to the stabilizer leg, we want to make sure we hit all of its own grease points ensuring that we hit the one at this point. This is one vital because it's usually missed and a lot of people will try to get it once the leg is folded up. We'll then move to the king post area and then finishing out at the boom and the dipper that have a multitude of points on them and the attachment at the end. Remember to reference your operator's manual before performing any of these checks. And these daily checks will maximize your machine's performance, expand the life of the components, and will decrease machine downtime.